which I planned for the uh, tournament. I had a four man tournament one night in uh, Manila, Philippines. Uh, training's going real good. Uh, my trainer Don is incredible. Uh, doing everything I need to be doing. And uh, uh, I'm ready, I'm ready to go. The rules are a little different. Uh, it'll be my first time fighting this uh, type of tournament. Uh, I should say this type of rules. Uh, but it makes no difference to me because uh, I can kick, I can punch, and I can knee. So the throws and the rest of the stuff is irrelevant uh, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, I'm ready to go. Uh, to me, it really makes no difference. Uh, I'm assuming they're all champions and world-class fighters, so whether I see footage or not see footage, it doesn't matter to me. I mean, the way I look at it is I'm training to fight the best in the world. So, you know, hopefully, I'm hoping that they show up uh, at their best. Because uh, when I win the tournament, you know, I don't want to fight uh, uh, anybody at half speed. Uh, I make no excuses, uh, and uh, I'm ready to go. So, hopefully, uh, my opponents are. I'm sure, I'm sure they will be, because they all seem like world-class fighters. No pressure really whatsoever. I mean, the only pressure is the pressure that I put on myself to uh, be the best I can be uh, every, every, every day, every training session, and, and every every fight. Uh, I mean, America's full of uh, good, uh, I should say, great Muay Thai fighters, um, and I'm just trying to add my name to the mix. And uh, this is the start right here in tournament in Manila. Uh, yeah, uh, once once I'm done with the. Uh, this tournament, uh, plan on coming uh, right back to Thailand and uh, staying as active as possible. Uh, looking to be, looking to try and fight uh, every two weeks. Finally, I mean, I have an opportunity to fight and stay active. I mean, I'm, I'm, my body's built to take a lot of, uh, uh, a lot of punishment in a short amount of time. It's just it's very hard to do that in the states. Uh, not enough good promotions in the U.S. There are some, but not enough. So now that I'm in Asia, uh, I'm ready to fight every. I fight every day if I can. No, uh, I, I, I will say I do enjoy uh, practicing the art of Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. It's a hobby, I think, it's just to make myself a better martial artist. But right now, my heart has always been and it will always be uh, 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 in Muay Thai. Um, I will continue to uh, progress in, in, in my belt ranking as far as Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu goes. But right now, I'm staying uh, with my fight and uh, uh, career in Muay Thai. I don't have any plans to leave or going back to MMA right now. Uh, my prediction is uh, I'm a retarded monkey, homeless chop somebody in the throat, win the whole tournament. No, I'm a, uh, my plans are uh, put on a good fight. You know, I don't want to say I'm, I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna do that. You know, all I can promise is that uh, I'm gonna go out there and fight hard. Seriously, fight hard. I'm not, and, and I tell you this, I'm not backing up. I'm coming forward constantly, the whole fight. So whoever, whoever I fight first, I uh, hope they come in good cardio shape, and I'm not backing up.